Hello internet. So let's talk about a life update. So recently, um, I've been working on a project that lasted for about two weeks because for this project, it was um, selected artists and I was one of the selected few that was actually selected to be showcased at this event. So it was an event called um, where we um, make work that was with electronics. So it was an electronics playground event. And I guess this video is kind of like a life update. So um, basically, I'm going to talk about a box that I recently um, built. And um, I'm just going to read it off paper, the project description, because it'll be more coherent and <laughs> it'll make more sense. Because if I just say what's ever running in my mind, it might not come across as um, articulate. So let's let me just grab a piece of paper. So this uh, project, I called it a uh, noisy lighty play box. And here I read the description of what it is. The project is an interactive box that plays noise and lights up when buttons are pressed. The box is constructed out of wood, paper, and electro electronic components. The electronics are running off an Arduino to instruct the inter interactivity of noise and lights. So yeah, basically um, I constructed this whole thing. Um, it's just right here, um, is this box. Uh, I actually built the entire thing, so this is the wood. I bought um, each of these pieces of wood from, um, uh, two boxes of wood from Michaels, and uh, I also built it out of popsicle sticks too, so basically that's still wood. <laughs> and electronic components, so you can see like there's buttons. And inside of the box, um, it's a bit nuts in there. Um, I actually have to pull the tool out, just one second. This part might be cut off. Okay, yeah, so I cut up the part where I was looking for the tools, so I just put my tool together right here, and I'm going to unscrew these locks so you can actually see what's actually inside this box. Also, um, um, put pictures on the side so you can kind of uh, have also a detailed view as well. Okay, so I'm taking the hinge off right now, and I'll show you a detailed of the insides. So yeah, I assembled all this with a soldering iron and you can see all the wires and connectivity right there. Um, here's a bit of the craziness that is inside of here. <laughs> yeah, I took a lot of time um, thinking about it and trying to pre-plan the construction of it so that the project would end up completed in time and for the deadline. And I accomplished it, so that is actually really good. So as you can see, um, Inside here, you can see that it's running off of that Arduino, and all the instructions are in here, and basically, um, the kind of uh, tool that I used in the project, um, the Arduino, I use the Tone Melody, um, I, get, I think that's a library? Um, well, if you search up Tone Melody um, with Arduino, um, I use that, then I manipulate the code and rewrite it a bit, um, so that it could do what I want to do um, when these are pressed. But I also will put a link below um, of the documentation of the event, so you can actually see people interacting with it and see how um, how this is like with this final project stage. Um, so yeah, I actually don't really know what else to say, but I hope uh, that's something that you're kind of interested in. Um, if you do want more details, um, I could make a second video about it, describing more of it and like how you put it onto the Arduino and I can also probably share the code as well because I used it from a code that was already used and all I just did was change a few lines and re-edit it and change it to the way that it would work for my project. So yeah, um, yeah, I guess that's it. So bye. Uh, oh yeah, and I forgot to say, uh, thanks for watching. Okay, bye.